Good morning. Rise and shine. Let's go. Light up, please. We live in an era where people are constantly taking pictures of everything, right? Yes, sir. Yeah. Today, more pictures are taken in a single day than the entire year, 1998. That's wild. That's a lot. Your generation doesn't ever think twice about what you put online. Oh, and no. as they say, oh, okay. what happens in Vegas stays in Vegas, right? Yes, Chef. But what you post on the internet oh, God. <laughs> also stays on the internet. <laughs> <laughs> what were you doing? 15. <laughs> Antonio's rocking that pimp coat. I mean, you know, he's, he's all about to come up. Check this one out. <laughs> the muscles, though. Yeah. And your what muscles. What the? That was my high school arms. showcase dance show. <laughs> Look at those guns. Oh, my yeah, God. Don't mess with me. What? <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Middle school is a bitch, Chef. Oh, my God. I was after a 14-hour day, probably. That's the, only, that's the only weird one I have. Is that your hair? <laughs> oh, my God. Look at the attitude of Miss Beyonce. Come on. Why? Why me? I'm sorry, Grandma. Oh. <laughs> Sam. <laughs> Sam. Pause for two seconds. Oh my god. Yo, that was tight back then, right? That was pretty dope. Dude. <laughs> yeah, uh, I was a teddy bear a couple years ago for Halloween, and I, I was fucking killing it, honestly. Oh my god. <laughs> Wait, is that a dead pig head? First date or second date? That my was my god. first date, chef. Selfie, and I kissed a pig. The bottom line is, everything from little moments to milestones are now captured. And today, we're about to celebrate a milestone in somebody's life. Now, take a look. Oh, oh. This is my first baby, Megan. Oh. And I cannot believe that she is 21 today. Wow. Right. Megan Jane Ramsey, come in here. Yeah. Well, good to see you. Thank uh, you, Dad. Welcome. Happy 21st. Thank you. Amazing. Thank you. Um, say good morning to the guys, Hi, guys. and girls. Good morning. Good morning. morning. Megan's so pretty. And then that accent is just like, oh my god. <laughs> it is Megan Ramsey's 21st birthday party. Listen carefully. Each team needs to prepare three appetizers and three very exciting entrees. Megan will select her three favorite apps and her three favorite entrees. They'll go on the menu this evening, okay? The team with the most dishes that make it onto Megan's menu for tonight wins the challenge. I think Megan definitely has a serious palate like her dad and knows good food, so I think this is gonna be a tough one. What are you looking for on a menu? I am definitely looking for a variety. And also, it's a party, so I want it to be fun right. and exciting. Is there anything you really don't like to eat? I'm not too keen on spicy food or broccoli. Got you. Allergies? No, no allergies. Yeah, I have an allergy. I'm allergic to boyfriends. <laughs> Trust well, me. Good thing I don't have one. Yeah, thank God for that. <laughs> yes? Yes. Your 45 Dad, minutes. I got this. Your 45 Make minutes it. starts now. Let's go. In today's creative challenge, each team must create a tasting menu of three appetizers and three entrees for Megan's 21st birthday celebration. Woo! You're flapping! He's flapping! Chef Ramsay's daughters are age, and so we definitely want to give her some, like, young kind of poppin' food. Just don't pinch me. It's not just yummy, but, like, Instagram-worthy, because, you know, the phone has to eat first. Sorry, little buddies. 20 minutes, guys, yes? Yes, Chef. It is my number one goal in the world at the moment to impress Megan Ramsey. Lollipops, you want to pull those out for me? They look beautiful. Trenton, myself, and Kevin are the only three who haven't gotten a reward yet, so I need it more than air. I, I just need, I need something. Who's going to be the lucky guy? Looks like you. 
Are there blood oranges somewhere? Did you look over there? The dish that I'm gonna be creating is titled by me, Sophisticated Bite of Summer. Oh, yo. Mm. I really gotta nail this challenge. I need to prove myself to the red team as well. This is like probably my favorite challenge so far. Just under four minutes, red team. Yes, chef. Yes, chef. You wanna taste my rice real quick? Peyton is here to stay. You know, maybe chefs see something in him that we don't, so I'm just trying to keep an open mind and move forward with him. Oh, Jesus, fuck. Sorry. It's a squirter. Coming around hot, I'm making a pad thai dish for Chef Ramsay's daughter's 21st birthday, so uh, definitely a big deal. You know, we don't want to mess that up. We got it, you guys. 30 seconds to go. Let's go. Can someone help me? Can someone help me? Seven. Oh, no, no. Six. Five. Get your plate four, up. Get your plate three, up. Get two, your plate up. One. And serve. Let's go. Woo! Excellent. Now, blue team. You have one extra app. I need a decision between you all on which app you're dropping. Let's go. Decide. You guys can drop the sliders if you want, because I think it might be a little too spicy. You sure? I don't want to serve something subpar. What appetizer are you dropping? Pork slider, chef. Because I think it might be a touch too spicy for Megan. Wow. I recognize that there is some things that are just too risky. Uh, Maggie, excited to taste? Yeah, I'm very excited. Let's start off with appetizers, please. Uh, let's go. Three from the red, three from the blue. In today's judging, right. Megan will compare appetizers from each team and judge them on a head-to-head -head basis. Let's start off with the first dish. The team with the most dishes selected for Megan's birthday party menu wins the challenge. Kaya, describe it, please. There are some sticky wings, which were breaded in flour with salt and pepper in the beginning. They are sticky. They're aren't very they? sticky. They're really good, though. They're great yeah. seasoning as well. Thank you so much. Uh, Blue team, let's start off with this. Looks like a salad. It's nice and light and fragrant. Stephen, describe the salad, please. It's a sesame crusted salmon niswa, so it's kind of like an Asian twist on a niswa salad. In a way, it's almost a bit hard to get to the stuff underneath because there's a lot going on. But the salmon has definitely cooked really well. I really enjoyed it. Right, um, Megan, we have to make some decisions. We have Kaya's sticky chicken wing lollipop or the Niswas by Stephen. First one is? Chicken oh, wings, definitely. They are my that. favorite. Yeah. I really enjoyed them. Kaya's lollipops are in. That's okay. definitely in. That is one to the red team. Uh, congratulations, Kaya. Good job. I am on cloud nine right now. The fact that Megan picked it right off the bat, it just showed that everything I did was worth it. The second round of appetizers has former teammates Emily and Bryn facing off. It's a lobster roll, and it has a little bit of grilled pineapple with it. Oh, mm. Dad, it's going to have fruit. <laughs> Sorry. And a tiny bit of white wine, because you know you got to sneak in your alcohol somewhere. I really like the pineapple bit, because at first I thought it was going to be a bit too sweet, but it's done perfectly. The second dish that you put forward for the blue team. Today, Megan, I made for you a roasted red pepper and corn fritter. And because you're 21, a little bit of tequila. Tequila and lime goes well together, oh, so yeah. perfect. Right. And Megan, how would you know that tequila and lime go together? See you on TV. OK. All right. <laughs> Good. I did enjoy it. It almost feels like it's missing something, because the pepper, there's not a huge amount of pepper inside. But yeah, no, it's good, and the sauce is really nice as well. Your second appetizer for tonight's menu. I know my friends really well, and I know that they love sliders. So for me, I think I might have to include the sliders. So that's the sliders and the wings are in from the red team. Congratulations. Well done. Yes! Megan picked my dish as one of them, and I'm so ecstatic. Yes! And the final appetizer, Sam. Yes, chef. Uh, describe the... Uh, well, it's like a canapé. If you will, it's actually a scallop, so I call it a sophisticated bite of summer. But it looks like a Scooby snack. <laughs> <laughs> Save me a little bite. Slow down, don't eat too fast. Enough. <laughs> okay, I'm okay. sorry, I'm really sorry. Oh, my lord. <laughs> so the sauce underneath is what? Uh, that is a blood orange cream with marscapone cheese. The sauce underneath is perfect. It's not too thick and it's not too light. I really enjoyed it. OK, uh, next one, whose is this? That's mine. Great. Antonio, describe it, please. It's a lobster bacon mac and cheese. Wow, that lobster's beautiful. Thank you, Chef. I love the uh, mac and cheese. That's cooked perfectly. Thank you, Not chef. too chewy and not too soft. Thank you. Mm. Our third and final lap. I think it's going to have to be the lobster mac and cheese. The lobster mac and cheese. Yeah, it's your wow. 21st. You've got to have mac and cheese in there somewhere. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Be back in it.
back in it. Let's start with your entrees. Each team has prepared three entrees for Megan to choose from. Thank you. Up first are dishes from Trenton and Josie. Let's start off with this one. Uh, it's a Filipino steak and eggs. Essentially, it's breakfast for dinner. Steaks cook really well. With the red team clinging to a narrow one-point lead, the blue team is hoping Trenton's pepper jam, chicken lollipops, can tie the score. It's seasoned perfectly, and the stickiness of the chicken with the sauce goes well together. I really enjoy it, thanks. I like it. It's fun. Megan, your first entree, which one would you like to put on the menu for tonight's party bash? I think it's going to have to be this one with the sauce on wow. the side. I really enjoyed that. For round two of entrees, Megan will face off against Peyton. Pan-seared salmon uh, underneath uh, prosciutto-wrapped asparagus. Uh, the rice is a mixture of herbs. I got dill, parsley, rosemary in there. Mmm. Wow, that rosemary is strong. OK. Next one, please. Rice noodle um, with a soy ginger peanut sauce. That peanut butter is really good. It's almost like a reminiscent of pad thai. Yes. Yeah, that was really good. Awesome. Thank you. Your second entree, please, Megan. Is the noodles. The, the noodles. Rice noodles. I really enjoyed those with the peanut butter. Wow. They are perfect. With the red team trailing by one, going to the last entrees. That's mine. Keanu is hoping her dish will keep the red team in the game. I made for you a smoked shrimp and grits. So we lift that up, and the smoke is there. That definitely yeah. looks fun. Even amazing. though you don't smoke, you promise you never smoke. <laughs> no, why no. are you bringing this in? Just no. checking, that's all. Um, okay. Everyone knows now. No. Well, it smells delicious. Meg, dig in. That was really good. I really enjoyed that. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> and then the final entree from the blue team, please. I made for you a purple potato puree in a New York strip. Great crust on there. How's it taste, Meg? Really good. Cooked perfectly. Thank you. Three to two. Oh, wow. Pick my dish. Please pick my dish. Please pick my dish. <laughs> I would definitely like to put the shrimp and grits one on there. Wow. That was amazing. <laughs> Now, Meg, a uh, tough decision. We have a tie. I'd like to look at all six dishes and then point to your favorite dish of all. I know it's hard. They're all so good. It has to be blue, it has to be blue, it has to be blue. I haven't had a reward yet, so I'm, I need something. Please, please, please. I do think it is going to have to be these, the noodles. <laughs> Yes. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Definitely a crazy feeling, you know, to be able to say I had the best dish up there. That's wild. I could raise the roof internally. <laughs> Good job. Uh, blue team, congratulations. Thank you, Chef. 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 It's the first time the blue team yes. are out of Hell's Ooh. Kitchen. Really? Yes. Uh, they want a challenge. Yes, yes. <laughs> wow.